In the very back, we have acorn squash, followed by spaghetti squash, then we have our zucchini, and then our yellow squash, our sugar snaps, and our pickling cucumbers, and our regular cucumbers. Right now, the yellow squash is starting to grow quite a few little um, starters on them. And we'll go back and look at those. Get a better view on this side. This is actually my neighbor's garden as well, but we're gonna borrow their space really quick. So as we look inside, we'll try and find one of the yellow squashes. Seems like it's hard to see here. We're gonna go back around and see if we can do a little bit better. We're actually gonna go inside the garden and pull out some of the leaves. But there are quite a few in here. There's our green zucchini. This is the beginning of July. Let's see if we can have, find some of our yellow. The fun part is always trying to find your plants. I was able to find them earlier, but it looks like they are hiding now. When I get a chance, I'll also trim away this excess foliage underneath, and I'll be help, help to see what's actually in there. There's another zucchini excited about that. Let's see. Oh, there we go. There's our yellow squash. So our yellow squash. They're actually getting quite big. So this is very exciting. Can't wait to have a bunch of vegetables. One thing you want to look at is make sure that they're firm. If they give a soft, if they come out soft in the beginning, you might as well toss them they won't grow correctly and your plant will focus a lot on trying to get them to grow. See, yeah, that one's nice and firm, so we'll leave it alone. Because the softer ones, yeah, the plant will work too hard trying to save those. And you want it to focus on your good squashes. All right, 